Hello, it's Meg and Happy New Year, I guess. So I haven't actually done a studio vlog since December, so I'm so, so sorry. Life has just been super busy. So I am in my last 10 weeks of uni now. Um, I kind of spent like January doing most of my dissertation and that took up a lot of time because I am not a natural writer. I've also had my other uni projects and client work and I just haven't got around to filming. Um, I feel like the studio is a little bit of a mess and everything's all over the place because I did get another printer and a heat press so there just isn't that much space to film um, and yeah I'm waiting to kind of move out of this place. So I've been finding it a little bit harder to film just because I feel like I'm between stages of my art career and I shouldn't be putting it off because when I actually film I love it but I just I just haven't anyway I'll stop making excuses so it is February 26th today um so yeah I've not spoken to you in like two months so I'm so so sorry but hopefully this will be the start of studio vlogs being a little bit more regular but by the end of the year definitely I hope to be doing studio vlogs every week or two weeks. This studio vlog is just going to contain some of the things I have been up to the last couple of months such as painting and some of the order packing I've been doing and I will speak to you later. Bye. So the first little look back that I'm going to show you is one of my painting videos. I've been creating a series for uni but also for my small business of positive paintings. I guess my title as an artist is a self-love illustrator because I love to illustrate different bodies and encourage people to love themselves but I also had a lot of requests for artwork with positive affirmations that didn't include bodies and I've been wanting to do this for quite a while but I felt that I didn't know how well it would be received by my audience because I've built it up as a body positive illustrator but anyway I've been doing these series of paintings and I am going to complete 12 of them for a very special product that I won't tell you about yet but yeah I've really really been enjoying it it's allowed me to progress my painting skills as a lot of the time I just work digitally and also just explore my style I think every year I have somewhat of a style crisis and I worry about where my art is leading me but yeah this has been so lovely because I've been able to carry on making body positive work along with these affirmation artwork paintings which are really relaxing to make so yeah I hope you enjoyed the little video of me painting these two and that this is the final product So I am coming to you on the 9th of March and I haven't spoke to you since the end of February. Um, I got Covid, well my partner got Covid and gave me it and I was knocked off my feet for about a week, just felt so exhausted, bunged up, tired and a cough. Um, the last couple of days have been the first days that I've kind of felt a little bit better and wanted to be back in the studio. So today I am going to paint. So I've got two sketches here I don't know if you can see this is the first one and this is the second one and yeah we're gonna be painting and I will take you with me it's voiceover Meg again and here I am doing two more paintings and I'm not going to talk over it this time I'm going to put some calming music along with it and let you enjoy some painting ASMR
hello so it's friday i was painting on wednesday with you i think um so i will show you the finished paintings this is the first one and it says you deserve the universe and i really really like the colors on this but i wanted to add more outlines so i'm gonna do that now it's dry and i'm either going to do it digitally or with colored pencil i'm going to experiment with the two and then the other one says you deserve to feel accepted loved and safe and i really really like this one it's really soft and pastel compared to the really bright colorful one um it's got a little envelope little painting up here and yeah i just think it's really sweet i've really enjoyed painting things that aren't um bodies i've always be like a body positive artist and that's what i primarily do but i think it's really nice to kind of put like affirmations into paintings in forms in other forms um so yeah i'm really really happy with this series i'm doing i think i'm on the 10th and i want to do 20 so we are halfway there um yeah so i am just doing a lot of admin work today nothing really to show you and i will speak to you soon so i got my delivery of these new prints and they are gold foiled which i've been wanting to do for so long and yet yeah, here they are they've got all these beautiful bodies on the front and they're also double sided and these are going to be available in the first shop update of the year so stay tuned to see how that went it's voiceover meg again so i just got my delivery from zap creatives and i ordered some hollow stickers so basically i always order five designs of vinyl stickers to give free in orders and yeah i'd run out so i ordered some more and i got the hollow effect this time and here are the five designs i love them so much i clearly went for like this rainbow positivity theme and yeah let me know in the comments which is your favorite as for organising them, I've just put them in this pink plastic box so I can get them when packing orders. And we're back with another unboxing of mini art prints. So when I first started my business, I released mini art prints and it was one of the first products I sold. So I wanted to bring them back in new designs. So I've got the self-love design and the self-care design and they'll also be available on the shop today. Hello, so it's Monday the 28th of March. It's been a while since I spoke directly to the camera. I feel like I'm still recovering from having COVID back in February. Um, I'm just really chesty, like some days I'm fine and then the next day I'm super exhausted and today I'm being so exhausted but I have lots of work to do. So I'm planning a shop update for the end of the week and I'm pretty sure you've seen me unbox this print which is the gold foiled print. 
and it's double sided um, I think I've shown you the mini prints so there's this one which says be kind to yourself and then the other side says love yourself and it's just like a really nice self care reminder and then we have the body acceptance one and this has some boobs and butts on this side and on this side we have some rainbow revolvers I'm really excited to bring them to the shop because I used to sell mini prints and they did really well so it's nice to bring some new additions and then today I am filming an unboxing and photographing the new monthly planners so I designed these in collaboration with Pinterest back in January and initially I was just selling them as single sheets so I printed out 12 of these sheets and would send them to customers because that obviously covered a whole year um, but I had lots of requests to get them in planner pad form so I've ordered these I'm really really impressed with the quality I really like them and it has 50 sheets so obviously would last years and years so yeah these will be added to the shop as well for the shop update and then obviously I have the freebie stickers which I'm pretty sure I've shown you let me grab them so these are the freebie stickers and they have like a hollow effect and yeah these are going to be free in all orders so yeah today is just going to be prepping as much as I can for the shop update doing some video content and yeah I will get back to you later bye good morning so it's Tuesday I feel a lot better than I did yesterday yesterday I just photographed the monthly planners um, which are these and I'm sure you've already seen them but yeah I, I really really love them um, so I just photographed them I will put some of the photos on screen and yeah then I spent the rest of the day in bed really because I've not been too well I feel a little bit better today though um, and yeah I'm really really happy with how my photography is progressing I feel like the past year I've really found almost my style in photography and I I've definitely self-taught myself some new techniques I also love Lightroom for editing and yeah they're not perfect by any means but I'm really happy with how they've progressed from when I first started my business so today I have got uni at three o'clock um, but I'm just gonna do the listings for the monthly planners I need to get the listings on my Etsy and Shopify because I have the shop release on Friday at 6 p.m. so yeah it is just a small shop release the first one of the year really i did bring out some new prints but they weren't but it wasn't a shop update but yeah this is really really exciting um i finished uni officially in five weeks so yeah i'm really excited that then i'll be able to concentrate full time on designing products on youtube on everything that my business needs but yeah it's definitely took a back seat the past three months just while i've been juggling final year uni but yeah I cannot wait to leave and I have really really exciting personal life news that kind of goes into the business as well that I want to share and I've wanted to share for like three months but I can't yet but hopefully by the next studio vlog I'll be able to tell you all about it but yeah for now I'm just going to do the listings and I will speak to you later so i'm just painting in the studio but i thought i would show you that it's snowing look how pretty it is but yeah today i'm just doing some uni work so i'm just painting a Josephine night tray and yeah i'm watching the real housewives which is my guilty pleasure and now i get to watch the beautiful snow
morning so today is monday morning and the shop update was on friday and it went really well i've got quite a few orders to pack up today so that is one of the big jobs so i'm gonna start packing orders now i normally list out the prints that i need to print on my printer and do that first because then i've got everything ready to pack so i'll take you with me Let me show you what we've just printed. So we've got some cards. This is the You Are Enough card. We've got the Stretch Marks card, which I love. Two Happy Birthday booby cards. Two of them. And then we go on to the A5 prints. So we have the Fat Sisterhood print. The Dreams print, which is so, so pretty and the ready to bloom one which I did on a idea pin with Pinterest and it was so fun. These are the 14 by 14 prints and I have to cut them myself. So we have a take up space print, um, the weight gain is normal print, a celebrate your body and a you don't need to hide your body. So I'll have to print, um, cut them out in a second. Then we have the A4 print, so we also have a Dreams A4 print and the details when it's on A4 are amazing. And then we have the classic, this was the first ever print I brought out, that's not ladylike print. So let's get packing orders. it might have taken all morning and I've created quite the mess but the orders are all packed and I always find it so satisfying looking at the tape but yeah I'm so so super grateful for everyone who supported me with the shop drop even if you didn't order and it was just a like on my post I am so grateful for every single one of you and now these are going to head off to the postie on their way hello so it's the week after the shop update and i'm gonna end the studio vlog here technically this has been a very long studio vlog i've been filming since february so yeah that's really poor but anyway it's finally ending um i feel like we've been through a whole journey in this studio vlog from painting packing orders 
getting new products in and yeah I'm gonna try and film a lot more regularly I know I said this earlier in the vlog but I've got some really exciting things coming up and I'm leaving uni in five weeks so stay tuned for life after uni and after having to prioritize that I'm really really excited anyway thank you so much for watching and if you want to see more make sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you next time bye